Blue Valley Mobile Home residents are worried. The one thing I'm concerned about is the children and the elderly that have breathing problems because of the air pollution with the, all the diesels. And while residents in Blue Valley worry about the adverse effects of a 100 bay trucking operation right next door, they also worry that industry around the mobile homes will eventually swallow them up. I am, because then if somebody ends up buying this area, I don't know where I would go. I would have to move my own mobile home and I don't have the money to do that. So yeah, and a lot of people around here don't have the money to do that. The city of Boise currently faces a challenge with creating affordable housing. So we're doing everything we can to, uh, to hold on to that affordable home stock there and to make sure that those folks can stay in their, in their place uh, if, if, they, if they can. We're, we're doing everything we can to try to do that. But to some degree, the city's hands are tied after they annex this land from Ada County. Because Blue Valley falls within the airport overlay zone, that means the trailer park can't be zoned as residential because of federal law. So at the design review meeting, the city will attempt to orchestrate a compromise. So going forward, we're hoping to that, that both sides can come together and find something that's going to be amenable to everybody. The design review board will consider requiring a sound wall and other safety measures, but residents worry about the future of their homes in this park that has been here since the 70s. Pretty much because we own our homes and not owning the land, we're kind of screwed on that. So yeah, it's, it's going to be rough. Steve Dent, six on your side.